Karen Tripp here with Cancer Companions. Time for weekly prayers. Woo! We got some great praises to be lifting up. I am so excited. Dayton last week was a blast. Linda and I sat down and had all of these incredible devotionals written by all of these authors and began to put them together into a 365-day cancer devotional. We got three months done, January, February, and March. We're going to be looking for readers soon. And God was so in the room. It's so blessed. I can't wait to share it with all of you. And we also are looking for volunteers. we got some major mailings coming up and would really love to be able to have some volunteers helping with that, as well as some uh, input that we need to be doing into some of our systems. Anybody that wants to help with that stuff, we're looking for volunteers for the Lord to pop up for us. And then the third thing is just guidance for our development committee. Our development committee is in the midst of determining um, just what's happening in terms of the campaigns for the rest of the year and would love God's guidance. So bow your head with me. Oh, Jesus, thank you, thank you, thank you for being in Dayton last week. I cannot tell you what a blessing it was to let you use Linda and I to begin to piece together this mighty work of all of these volunteers building a 365-day devotional um, just for folks with cancer. What a blessing and gift it's going to be. Lord, we also ask you to send volunteers. We're finding more and more work and less and less hands, and yet we know you've picked people out to help this ministry. And so have them contact us. Have their hearts be moved to be able to be in, in, in sync with us and the needs of this ministry. And Lord, we also place before you every person that's on our development committee as they begin to use your discernment and your wisdom to figure out the next steps uh, for funding campaigns for the rest of this year. We know this is your ministry and not ours, and so we gladly place it in your hands. Amen. Thanks, guys.